Hi, welcome to Code Chappi. Today we are going to see the demo for Employment Management app using Android Studio. Let's see how to start the Android project. First, I will explain the project folders. These are the project folders. First folder is Android SRC. Android Studio built folders for the Android SRC. We can all web folders are there. The WW folders or source codes are there instead of source code. Document, all documents are there. These are the delivery folders. Click the readme files. You can view the all login details. Admin login or employee login. You can view all login details are there. Let's move the how to start the Android project. First, open the XAMPP control panel and open it. Apache is a package server. MySQL is a database storage. Start Apache and start MySQL. MySQL admin button. It promotes open web browser. Now, database is open in left side. Further, it see this project. Next, open the Android Studio and open it. The Android Studio build folders for Android SRCs. Import the Android SRCs. These are the web folders. Below minimize button, you can see the AVD Manager icon. Click and open it. Click here, launch button. Now, emulator is loaded. This is how to start the Android project. Let's move the App explanations. Open employment app. There are two models. You can view the readme files. First, admin portals. You can view the web folders. This is for the control panel folders. You copy the URL and paste the web browser. These are the controller login, admin login. Copy the admin email ID and password and paste it. Click sign in. Admin will manage in the models like add employee, add payroll, add task. First, you can click the add employee. If you want to create new employee details, enter the employee details like employee ID, employee name, email ID, enter all the details. Now come back to the home page. Employee, click employee details. What are the employee creates? You can view the employee details. You can view all the details. If you want to delete, delete options are there. Now come back to the home page. Next, you can click the Next, you can click the Add Payroll. You can choose first, you can create a new payroll, enter the payroll details. First, you can choose the employment ID. Next, you can choose the month, what month you can enter the payroll. Choose, you can anything, any month. Enter the basic salary and allowance. Click Submit it. Payroll details submitted. Okay. What are the creates? You can view the payroll details. You can view all the details. What are the creates? You can view all the details. Final salary. Automatically. If you want to increase percentage the salary, you can enter the percentage. For example, 50 percentage or anything you can percent. And click submit it. Automatically percent of the salary is increased you can 18,000 you can automatically increase as now come back to the home page click shift scheduled if you want to what are the creates shift scheduled you can enter the first you can choose the employee ID numbers and you can choose uh, shift date what date you can uh, shift scheduled enter the shift time
click add shift schedule submitted next you can click the attendance details if you want to create a new attendance detail first you can choose the employment ids enter the working days and present days click submit it attendance submitted successfully click ok click bio data if you want what are the create user side you can view the bio data details now come back to the home page click leave approval you can view the review approval next uh, models next you can click the add task if you, want, if you want to create a new task assignment you can uh, enter the details first you can choose the employment ids and next you can uh, enter the task what date you can have uh, finishing the task you can enter all the details click submit it task creator successfully what are the task create you can view the task management details if you want to click what are the task created you can view all the details scheduled date if you want to edit options or there if you want to update or if you want to delete options or there now come back to the home page click notice if you want to create a new notice enter the notice details like date notice title notice notice descriptions enter all the details Click Center Notice Creator successfully. What are the grades? You can view the user sites. Now log out the admin models. Let's move the user login. Copy the user email id user at gmail.com. Password is test. Click sign in. Sign in successfully. Employee models, you can view the models like bio data. You can notice, you can view all the details. First, click the bio data. If you want to create a new bio data, enter the bio data details like name, father name, date of birth. Enter all the details. Click submit it. Bio data created successfully. Next, you can click the attendance. What are the update the attendance? You can view the details. Admin side at update the attendance. You can view the details. Next, come back to the home page. Click notice. What are the create the notice? You can view the notice details. What are the admin side you can create? What are the creates? You can view all the details what type of notice descriptions you can view date what date you can uh, notice you can view all the details now come back to the home page click shift scheduled what are the creates in admin side you can view this shift scheduled details 27 6 2003 level 2 level pm you can view all the details date and them now come back to the home page next you can click the leave request 
if you want to create a new leave request form enter the request form details like from date to date what date you can leave provided can be all the details next you can what subjects you can leave provide you can need leave you can enter all the details next you can um, enter the descriptions what type of need leave you can enter body of the letter you can enter the details Next click the submitted, leave submitted successfully. Next what are the leave creates? You can view the leave test status, uh, the leave status or uh, approval or uh, rejected or pending, anything you can view it. What are the response uh, pending or accepted now pending, uh, admin will manage in the status. Uh, now come back to the home page. Next, you can click the payroll. What are the creates payroll? You can view the details. Admin said, what are the creates? You can view all the details. If you want to print the payroll, you can print options out there. Click print it and now come back to the home page. Click task details. Admin said, what are the create tasks? You can view the task details. What are the tasks are there? can uh, view description so you can view all the just date what date you can finishing can view all the details uh. now come back to the home page uh. click document you can view the document if you want to download download options are there apply appointment order you can document you can view all the details and now come back to the home page uh. next move the admin login admin login click biodata what are the user says create biodata you can view the biodata details name father name you can view all the details now come back to the home page next click the leave appraisal what are the leaves ids email id you can choose a uh, email ids employee ids you can view the what from date to date message what message you can uh, need a leave you can view all the details if you want to accept or if you want to deny you can options are there now update the status uh, click up update the status accept response ok next add the features you can if you want to upload the document you can upload it if you want to what are the you can view the leave letter you can view the leave letter forms now come now come back to the user login next you can click the leave, de leave status details you can view the status details now accepted the status you can view the accepted you can view all the details now come back to the home page now log out the user models our demo is completed now thank you